Hey everybody, I'm Brian with AromaCup.com and thank you guys as always for joining me here in my virtual coffee shop brought to you by AromaCup.com. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a side by side by side by side comparison of four, all four of the current machines in the Tassimo, Bosch Tassimo uh, single serve coffee brewer line. So we're going to be talking about all these really cool machines. I've done some in-depth reviews of all of these machines, done a lot of recipes and other cool things. So you want to check out our other videos if you want to find out some more very in-depth information. I'm just going to give you some quick overviews and comparison of the features between these machines so that you can know more about them when you go to buy yourself one of these great machines. So let's dive in and talk about all the different options available to you on these different Tassimo machines. So we've gone ahead and labeled each of these different machines because uh, you're, you know, there's a lot of different model numbers for each of these different machines, but let me just give you an overview of what we've got to start off with. Uh, what I have right here is I have the Tassimo T65 on my right hand side. This is essentially the sort of Cadillac of the Tassimo line at this time. Right next to it, we have the uh, Tassimo T10. This machine is a great entry level uh, single serve machine. Just to my left of that one, I have the Tassimo T20. This is just a little bit of a step up uh, from the T10. And then over here, we have one that we've spoken about many times in the past. That's the Tassimo T45 Suprema. This is uh, one of the first machines we started using by Tassimo and definitely still one of my favorite machines. So let's start off talking about the Tassimo T65. Again, as I say, this is uh, definitely the sort of the Cadillac of the Tassimo line at this time. I'll tell you about some of the differences with this machine between the other ones. We'll just compare everything. So the T65, let's talk about the water tank first. T65 is a 61 ounce water tank. Uh, compare that to the T10's water tank, which is 68 ounces, which is actually the biggest water tank of all of these machines. The T20 has the smallest at 50 ounces. And then you've got the T45 with a 61 ounce tank. So all these tanks are pretty well sized. The T20 is definitely a little bit small, but you know, again, these are easy to fill up with filtered water and, and you're still going to get a good number of drinks out of any of these tanks. But if tank size is important to you, you're going to want to go with one of the machines uh, that is not the T20 when you really come right down to it. Now on the T65, it's got a number of options which these other three machines do not. Namely, it has this LCD screen right here on the unit. This LCD screen, uh, when it's lit up, it gives you status of the machine. It tells you when you're brewing. It tells you if you're cleaning the machine, things like that. None of these other machines have that. And in addition, uh, the T65 also has an LED light which will light up the cup tray. And that's something that none of these other machines have. So those are basically the features of the T65. They're not included on the other machines, but let's talk about some of the similarities in all of these machines. All of the Bosch Tassimo single serve coffee brewers feature a one button operation. You're going to notice that on all of these machines I've got this one button. Now that button is all I need in order to brew my drink. I just simply need to go ahead and press that button after inserting a tea disc into the brew basket and after I've done that the machine is going to go ahead and it's going to brew my drink. Now in addition all of these machines feature inside of their brew basket the uh, the patented barcode scanning system this is very specific to the Tassimo line. This is something that we've only seen with Tassimo machines in the world of single serve coffee. And that specifically is that inside of the brew basket, we have a barcode reader. That barcode reader is going to read a code on your tea disc and that way the machine is going to know exactly the type of drink that it should go about making. So that's something that's very, very different from just about any other single serve machine. Now, something that is new uh, to some of the newer machines that I've got here, like the 10 and the 65, is going to be the uh, new T-Disc, Enhanced T-Disc holding system. Now this Enhanced T-Disc system is not 
currently, it's not, it's not on the T45, it's not on the T20, but this is a new system that you're going to be seeing on Tassimo machines. What this does is when I press this release button right here, and I'll show this to you one more time, open up that brew basket, press that release button, this plastic ring pops up. That plastic ring holds down the T-disc to make sure that you get the most pressure out of your T-disc when you happen to be brewing using the machine. And uh, I suspect you're going to be seeing that on all of the Tassimo machines from now on. Uh, going on about some of the other things that are pretty much the same through all of these units, they each have different removable trays. Uh, now, in the case of the T20, its tray can actually be removed and then lifted up and attached to the unit again in order to allow you to brew easily into very small mugs. Or you can take the trays out on all of these machines in order to brew into larger tumblers and things like that. Uh, so you can make a number of different sized drinks making use of these trays. The trays do remove differently on some of the machines as I mentioned. Uh, in addition, when we're talking about brewing, that's something I should mention is that all of these machines use the same T-discs. So it doesn't matter what machine it is that you're using, you're going to be able to use the same T-discs in order to brew all the same drinks. That includes iced drinks, hot drinks, specialty drinks as, such as cappuccinos, lattes, hot chocolates, things like that. And you can also use these machines to do a number of other things around the house, uh, such as making hot water for hot cereals, noodle uh, meals, and many other different things. And you can even make your own coffee if you make French press coffee, utilizing the ability to make hot water using all of these machines. Now, again, talking about brewing, all of these machines feature the brew pause fu uh, function. What this means is that in the middle of my brew cycle with any of these Tassimo machines, I can simply press on the brew button. When I press the brew button, I'm going to stop the brewing process and then I can hold that button down in order to run hot water through my tea disc and customize my drink exactly as I would like it. The finish is a little bit different on all of the machines. You see that, that uh, in the case of the T45, its outer shell is a little bit different from uh, the T10, which has more of a glossy black going on, and the T20, which has a very glossy finish. All of them stand at 11 inches tall, so they're very slim, fit very easily onto a countertop. Uh, some of these machines, such as uh, the T20, you can actually customize the color of the faceplate on the unit, which is very cool. This is a new accessory that you can make use of from Bosch, so if you want to customize your machine a little further, you can do that. All of these machines feature quiet uh, technology. Uh, they do have pumps in them which are quite high pressure and so sometimes depending on the drink that you're making you may hear that pump doing a little bit more work but overall very very quiet machines also very low power consum consumption on all of these units so that'll keep your power bill down and of course be nice to the earth. Now if we're going to talk about anything else that's different about these machines features that one has uh, that the others do not. Again, we're going to have to look at the T65. T65 with that LCD screen, that LCD screen is multilingual and uh, you can change that language based on whatever settings you may wish to use. Those settings will uh, reflect in the language that you're going to see on that LCD screen. And of course, that LCD screen is going to give you a status of your brew. You're not really going to have that on any of these other machines. You are going to know when it's done brewing because it'll stop brewing but the LCD screen is actually going to tell you exactly where you are at when it comes to the brew process on the machine. I'll give you just a little bit of a front profile on each of these and we'll just kind of go ahead and finish up right here. Now, as I say guys, when we're talking about a comparison side by side between these machines, the last thing you're probably going to be wondering about is the cost of each one, right? Well, Pricing on Tasmo machines is quite good. At the making of this video, the Tasmo T65 is retailing at $169.99. So that's pretty darn good for getting into the world of single serve coffee with a machine that's quite fancy and has a lot of bells and whistles. If we take a look at the T10, the T10 is uh, retailing currently at $99.99. 
as is the T20, also retailing at $99.99. Now, I'm not sure exactly why they are priced the same, except that they're pretty much the same machine, except for the water tank on the T20 is the smallest water tank of all of these Tassimo machines. But again, same functions going on between these two, but different tray types between the T10 and the T20, but still has that same single button technology, gonna brew the same T-discs, things like that. So same pricing between these two. Finally, on the T45, the machine I've spoken about a whole lot here on aromacup.com, done a lot of recipes with, and many, many other things. This machine is retailing at $139.99. So if you're looking to get into single serve coffee, you probably wanna take a look at the T10 or the T20. These two machines are really great entry-level single-serve machines from Tassimo. Uh, priced real nice at $99.99. They come literally with everything that you need to get into the world of single-serve coffee. And all you need after that is some tea discs and start customizing your own drinks. If you want to step up a little bit, go to the T45. Again, $139.99 on the retail price. Very nice machine. Still has many of the same functions as these two that I've got right here in the center, and even as the T65, one button operation, large water tank, things like that. But if you really wanna step up all the way, go to the T65, 169.99 retail on that one. It's got all the bells and whistles, including the LCD screen, the cup stand light, and um, not the largest water tank of all of these units. Uh, again, that title is going to belong to the T10, it's got the largest water tank out of all of these units at 68 ounces, 61 ounces on the T65. Again, 50 ounces on the T20 and 61 ounces on the T45. So that's pretty much all the differences on these machines. Again, the operation pretty much the same throughout each one. You can check out our other videos to see how they operate and some recipes that you can make with them, of course. Uh, really just depends on the pricing that you are looking to get into, what your budget is for a single serve machine. But even going up to the T65 at $169.99, it's pretty darn good to get into the world of single serve coffee. Uh, and I should also mention that the drinks that come out of these machines, same great quality between all of them, very nice hot brew, allows you to do a lot of different drinks, including ice drinks, specialty drinks, uh, simple coffees, espressos, all those kinds of things. And if you check out our other videos for our Secrets of Tassimo Brewers, you're going to find out how you can use all of these machines to be able to make a number of other different uh, beverages, meals, and a lot of other cool things that you can do using just a Tassimo machine in your own at-home coffee shop. So there you go, everyone. That's a side-by-side-by-side-by-side -side -side comparison and quick review of all of these machines uh, currently offered by Bosch Tassimo. Uh, again, if you're looking to get into the world of single serve coffee, I really think a Tassimo machine is a great way to do it. Uh, there's one last thing I should go ahead and mention, which is that folks wonder right now, is there a way for them to make their own coffee uh, in T-disc format using a Tassimo machine? There's currently not at the making of this video. There is no way to use your own coffee in a T-disc in one of these machines. Unfortunately, uh, we don't know at this time if there's going to be an option such as that. But as I say, check out our other videos to find out how you can do things such as make French press coffee utilizing a Tassimo machine. So there you go, everyone. I hope that you found this useful. Uh, if you're looking for some more information, check out our other videos so that you can find out even more in-depth usage information on these machines. But I hope that this helps you to make a good educated decision when you go out to buy one of these machines. Please join us on our, at aromacup.com. You can find more great information, recipes, coupons, joiner forums, talk with other coffee lovers, find all the great information to help demystify the world of single serve coffee. That's what we do best here at aromacup.com. And I thank you guys for joining me here in my virtual coffee shop brought to you by aromacup.com. I'm Brian. I hope to see you guys next time. And as always, enjoy your cup. Take care.